Hey guys and welcome to another video. I'm here at M and D's, Scotland's only theme park, Scotland's favourite theme park. Uh, we're here at the OMG Nights, I think it's called. The I think it's five till nine. So we'll be here till nine when, when it's starting to go dark. There's Luke and Lauren waiting to go on the big half apple. Not the big apple anymore. I'm not really sure what's going on with that. Mad Mouse is one like that. The mine train, can't remember its name, don't know if it even has one, but I want to ride that as well. White water on this nice and hot sun, sunny day, gotta do that. The flying carpet, legend to pitch. Luke and Lauren have come off the Caterpillar and we've just come off the Mad Mouth. What did you think of it? They were both amazing. Really? Yeah. Okay. Well, not amazing compared to other stuff I've done, but they were both really fun. I started filming on that one and the camera ran out of the top of the lift hill. So, well, that's failed. There's the camera. So I need to put batteries in it. You may get a POV of that. If, you, if I do one, it'll be in here. Um, if not, because it's got a really long queue and it's got really bad input. Throughput, sorry. But Lauren is queuing or might even be on the caterpillar again. And yeah, what's your favourite out of the two, Luke? Right yeah. Of the queue? Yeah. What's your favourite of the two? Uh, the Mad Mouth, definitely. Yeah, it's a lot better. Um, so yeah, we're going to wait for Lauren to my and see what else. Okay. Look, Lauren's just going to... Guys, we're on the Ferris wheel. And it's spinning. A spinning Ferris wheel. Yeah, we can do it again. Look, there's the Mad Mouse. And the Caterpillar and the Log Flume. It's going down empty. Oh, the Log Flume's got no view. Uh, tornado in the distance. We're right at the top. Yeah, it looks really nice. It's very windy though. But, oh, and there's the mine train and the magic carpet. Yeah. So, I think we'll catch up uh, when we're next on a ride or going on a ride. On white water, we finally said enough, enough. We didn't get that wet, but we wanted to go somewhere else. So I think we're going to the wave swinger, but we might drop off at the mine train or maybe even the magic carpet. But I'm not sure. But uh, good day. How wet did you get? Not very. Your hair's very wet. It doesn't feel it. 
How wet did you get? What? How wet did you get? Very, I got very. I can wet it. Hey, yeah, you heard it from Lauren first. She was at the front though. Yeah, she was at the front all three times. Yeah, I think we'll go on the uh, legend. Carpet. Yeah, the magic carpet, whatever that's called. Yeah, so, yeah, see you on the ride. Starting to lower. We've just had two rides on that. Uh, really fun, never done one of them before. I need to make sure to do them in the future. How did what did you think of the flying carpet? Awesome! Yeah? So best ride here so far? The flying carpet. Oh my mouth. Yeah. I'm stuck between the two. Hello, what have you just come off? Dumbo, what did you think of it? Good. I Good. I'm not tall enough for it. I know. <laughs> and you weren't tall enough for that, were you? But oh well. We're going on the mine train now. Oh. We are back row on the mine train. The mine train, that's the name. There's a lift hill. Train. Very good. Two rides, me and Dad did back row and then we did middle row. <laughs> what did you think? It was brilliant! What did you think? What? Of the mine train. It was quite good. Yeah? The back row was better, pulled you right over quickly, a bit smoother. Yeah. Right. Yeah, that was the weird thing, the back row was smoother than the middle row. I'm not sure whether it's just the car I was in. But the car I was in the second time, it rattled a bit, the back row was a lot smoother. But, uh, yeah, very enjoyable ride. Here's the uh, technical spec, 35 metres high. Well, so we're just heading to get some hot chocolate, I believe. It's Adventure Mini Golf. I Luke the, is taking I, his shot. Mum! Mum's already taken hers. I'm not really sure what Luke's doing. Um, unlucky. Lauren managed it there.
Cape Tornado, was it? Yeah. And then we came off the Dancing Galleons and now we've just come off Moby's Revenge. So first of all, what did you think of Tornado? Uh, it wasn't as bad as I remember it being. The first time I went on that was the worst time I've been on a roller coaster, but I think because I knew it was a really bad bit after the second loop, I braced myself and it was okay actually. It wasn't yeah, too in bad. fact, you might even know the lift hill's in the way. It's this bit here where the old jolt, you couldn't really see it. Yeah. But because we'd already braced for it, we didn't find it that bad. You didn't do it, did you? No. Too scared? Yeah. Yeah. And then we did that, which was really fun. That one there. We've just come off Moby's Revenge, which I got a lot wetter than usual on the straight one. And Luke got soaked on the curvy one. Luke took the camera with him on that one because mine was just a straight drop. So, where do you want to head now? I'm going to do Condor. We've decided against it okay. because it's just a spinny ride. Dodge gyms? Dodge gyms? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so we're going to the dodge gyms. Oh yeah, 
Train in the dark, runaway train, I think it's called. Yeah. Film PRV, Music Express, where you saw that. Uh, yeah, very good day. I really like it at night. What do you think? I think that a lot of people say, oh, it's like, say that it's not that great, but it's not like comparing it to all the theme parks that matters. It's like how fun it is. It is, and it's a lot of fun. What do you think? Uh, yeah, it's been a good evening. I think mean, you can't complain for five quid, really, can you? No. It's been, uh, quite good. It's been very busy. It's the busiest I've seen them in these. Yeah. If you understand why. Yeah, it's, so been a very, it's been a resounding success for the yeah, park. Time to head off, I think. Yeah. Something. Might be actually. What's, your, what's been your favourite ride out of everything? That's the top one. Either the magic carpet thing with what's it called? I don't know, it's the German. music express. That was good. Or the main train. Or the runaway train. I've got to oh, Okay. I've got to say the runaway mine train. Yeah, that was cute. That was so uh, cool. it was really fun. Tornado. Tornado was a lot better than I remember it being. It actually enjoyable for me. My dad wasn't so keen on it again, but he found it better than he did last time. But I enjoyed it this time, which is different. Uh, yeah, here's the Night Mover Waltzer. If only we'd have ridden that, it looks so good with all the loud music playing. But next time, we left it too late. That's what happened, isn't it, Luke? Yeah. Wow, that is so mad. There's the evil Sukin. Yeah. And there's the 365 open all year, that complex there. That's the theme park seasonal operation, like everything in every theme park in Great Britain. But yeah, we're just going to head off back to the car, into the car park. It's been a really good day there. And uh, I'm looking, we've got me a lot more looking forward to Blackpool Pleasure Beach in a few weeks' time. So stay tuned for that. But for now, I've been Matthew Howarth. I've been Luke. I've been Luke Howarth. And this has been M&D's vlog and I hope you enjoyed. Don't forget to like and comment and subscribe and that's that.